Rod Bent Arena at the Kentucky Expo Center will host LFA 180. Yeah, the event will feature more than a dozen MMA battles. And our Sam Carter is live this morning at Broad Bent Arena where it's all going to happen uh, with a little preview of what we can expect. And he's been getting physical. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. LFA 180 is tonight, guys. There are still tickets available either at Ticketmaster or you can walk up to the door if, you know, computing ability is not your thing. You can get tickets at the door. I'm joined right now by Michael Chiesa, top 15 UFC fighter ranked in the whole wide world and his broadcasting partner tonight. This is Ron Kruk. Ron, I want to start with you this time because Michael's a little afraid of me right now and I want to give him I a second to just time. hang out. Look at that. Um, the Ron, there. you know, when people come out to this, because we wanted to come out to this thing, great seats still available, Ticketmaster or walk up. Um, you know, what's it like seeing a fight live? Because I'm a big fight fan, but I've never seen one live. So what's it like seeing it live? I've always said uh, hockey, boxing, and MMA. There's nothing like it live. It, TV, it's great, you're gonna love it, but there's something about being a part of the atmosphere. It's electric to hear the shots and to see the reactions. There's nothing like it. You gotta get tickets, you gotta come out to LFA 180. Absolutely, and, and Michael, you know, we were talking about this a little bit off camera, but for the fighters, when they're making that ring walk and that door shuts behind him, do you shut the, I mean, just for you, I mean, do you shut the crowd out? Do you let them in your mind a little bit? How is that, what is, what's it going to feel like when they step in here? You know, for a lot of guys, and I know I'm not the only one that feels this way, but it's once you walk past that curtain and your song comes on and you're making that walk, that's what you train for. It's like, you're, you're just kind of going through the motions of the nerves all day, but once you get to make that walk and you get inside the octagon, that's what you train for. That's the reward of all the hard work you put into the 68-week training camp. And, and uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a blessing. I know every time every fighter loves that feeling when they get under those bright lights on the big stage in front of the loud crowd. This is what we train for. This is what we live for. You got to be ready to run through a wall, Michael. Yeah, well, you got to be ready to go, your buddy. Your right here, buddy. That's a, that's a, <laughs> buddy. What way to get to? Michael, you don't want me. You still got fight left in you, buddy. Um, you know, a big main event featuring um, a Louisville kid in it Lance tonight. Lawrence. Lance Lawrence. Um, I had to be a last-minute replacement, unfortunately, because his opponent was injured in training. But um, still an incredible main event. Take me through a little bit about, about that and what people can expect. It's going to be a lot of fun. Lance Lawrence is so super pumped to be here in his hometown of Louisville. His mom will be here. All his family and friends will be here. Louisville, you got to come out and support this guy, but you got to give uh, Landry Ward from Texas some credit too. He's running into a buzzsaw tonight. It's going to be a great fight. Main event uh, could go either way. Both these guys on the cusp of with a win, maybe getting to the big show in the UFC. Yeah, you see it all the time, honestly. A fighter taking a fight on short notice and either the guy not being ready or being ready to go and, you know, su surprising a lot of people. Both these guys are ranked in the state and nationally. It's going to be a really incredible spectacular. More than a dozen fights, a couple of amateur. The women are getting involved as well. It's going to be a great time. Tickets are still available either online at Ticketmaster or with walk-up. Michael, I was going to fight you on the air. I really was. I was going to be like, Michael, we should do this, but we're on live television, and I didn't want to embarrass you. So it's all good, indeed. Oh, now, Carter's okay. in trouble. We will, uh, <laughs> we'll, I will hopefully <laughs> stop talking junk to Michael, and I'll oh, see you guys on, on Monday. <laughs> Maybe. Sam, Sam do this. Flavor. You tap, feel tap. it right away oh, when yeah. a pro tap does out, that. Tap out. It's time to tap out, Sam. Monday. You got to know when. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we don't know what Sam's got up his sleeve. Maybe he's MMA trained, and we just don't know. Yeah, I guess we'll never find out, Matt. Or maybe. Maybe next year. All right, we'll see.